Well, now let's take a look at this beautiful 19th century binding, which is an autograph album. Look at that arabesque design right there. This is all embossed. Here we have this beautiful floral gilt spine, this great central block with a quill pen and an inkwell and an autograph book. And what's interesting in here is uh, that it begins here uh, with this little Great Falls 18, it looks like 60 uh, something, I can't quite make it out. Uh, but then it, here's another Great Falls, New Hampshire. There was a picture here, but it's gone. This leaf is loose. And then we've got some blank pages. There's another one, from Great Falls. And then here is a photograph of a man with no signature. Here is a woman with no signature. Here is someone, but their picture is gone. Ellen, someone, their picture is gone. Great Falls. So it's, it's, it's hard to understand or figure out exactly why some of these had 1862 that's what it is yes great falls new hampshire and here's 1862 so it's right in the civil war and now here's a photograph it's hard to understand why um some of the photographs are here but no picture and then there's signatures but no picture and then sometimes there's a signature but the picture's been removed and now here is this one from acton maine okay and then there's that one where it's gone from sanford maine 1862 Acton, Maine. This is actually quite close to us here in Dover. Uh, Sanford, yes, this is not far, like so. And here's Dover, actually. Sarah Ward, August 1862 in Dover. And here's Eliza, was that Rand? Rand, Rand in Dover. And here's Mary Horn, I think. And here's a calling card of Miss Helen Davis. It's got that, it's on that laminated type of paper of the era, glazed paper. And here is a Berwick, Maine, 1881. So now we skip ahead almost 20 years. And there's still quite a few blank pages in here, or pages that you could repurpose for your own scrapbook. Uh, it's, yeah, so there's quite a bit of blank pages in here. It's really, uh, in part, in many ways, a beautiful binding of the era with some autographs in it from New Hampshire and Maine. Uh, but that's how it survives, that's what it is, and that's how we're offering it. So it is available now online from me, Brian DeMambro.